We head back to Washington County now to track the travel of some very unique dinner plates. The Transylvania Club of Sandersville has been selling the kitchenware for 80 years now. It is this week's Making Middle Georgia Great. It is only for the state of Georgia. Because like a proud mother. It's Cherokee Rose, peaches, and cotton. Diane Mathis affectionately holds the plates that have become a Georgia icon. And it all started in Sandersville with one woman back in 1932. Luis Irwin, a member of the Sandersville Transylvania Club, wanted to create something that showed off Georgia's history. I think she thought that the plate displayed the history of the state of Georgia quickly. The plates come in two colors. The borders are all the same. There's the Savannah. The first steam ship to cross the ocean. The ruins of Fort Frederica. Which is at St. Simons. But there are 12 different center designs. There's Wesleyan yes. College. It's the first female college in America and portraits of some of Georgia's Confederate soldiers. Yep. But perhaps the plate's biggest claim to fame was when Jimmy Carter created a resolution. That made the plate the official state plate of Georgia. But the plate's travels didn't stop there. Carter then went on to the White House, and you guessed it, he brought his set of plates with him, pictured here in his private dining room. Not only do the plates have a pretty significant historical aspect to them, there's something else that makes them great. Proceeds from all the sales of the plates go right back here to the local library. You really can teach a history lesson from these plates. And more than a history lesson, more than a fancy wall decoration, these plates are fully functional too. The artistic part of the plate is not hampered in any way by this plate going in the dishwasher. We do say though, do put your dishwasher on the crystal china uh, setting. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, good advice. Now to purchase any of those plates, you can just head to our website, 41NBC.com. We've posted a link to the Transylvania Club's website. That's where you can get information on the list of vendors. And if you know how somebody is making Middle Georgia great, let me know about it. You can send me an email that is kwarnke at 41NBC.com.